A Conover man is charged with multiple counts of felony probation violation. He was on probation as a result of convictions in 2021 and earlier this year. The suspect remained in jail and has multiple upcoming court dates. 26-year-old Robert Vaughn Pippen of 4th Avenue Southwest in Conover was arrested yesterday by probation and parole officers. He's charged with four felony counts of probation violation. Pippen is on probation as a result of convictions in October and November of 2021 and January of this year. He was convicted of larceny, attempted larceny, injury to personal property, larceny of a motor vehicle, forgery, and uttering a forged instrument. The October conviction occurred in Iredell County. The others were in Catawba County. Pippin was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $25,000 bond. District court dates are scheduled for April 11th and May 20th. A superior court date is also set for May 20th. 51-year-old Harold Douglas Scott of North Caldwell Avenue in Newton was arrested last Thursday by Conover police officers. He's charged with felony possession of a firearm by a felon and misdemeanor possession of marijuana. Scott was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $10,000 bond. He remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court appearance is scheduled for April 21st. The next suspect is a Lincoln County resident who is charged with heroin trafficking here in Catawba County. 22-year-old Madison Dare Winslow of River Meadows Court in Lincolnton was arrested by Maiden police officers. Winslow is charged with trafficking opium or heroin, possession of drug paraphernalia, and failed to heed light or siren. The suspect was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility this morning under $10,000 bond. A district court date was scheduled for today. 36-year-old Joseph Randy Lee Sheffield of Mennonite Church Road in Hickory was arrested yesterday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. He's charged with larceny of a motor vehicle and possession of a stolen motor vehicle. Sheffield was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $9,500 bond and remained in jail as of earlier today. District court appearances are scheduled for this Thursday and April 26th. Reporting from Catawba County for WHKY-TV News, this is Rob Eastwood.